A new debate is raging in the city of Ann Arbor over crosswalks. As police issue more tickets, some drivers say the ordinance to protect pedestrians goes too far. Steve Garagiola sorts out the arguments from both sides. The city of Ann Arbor is very pedestrian friendly, and there are lots of pedestrians. The state law says a pedestrian crossing in the street has the right of way, but in Ann Arbor, it's a little trickier. Ann Arbor's gone one step further, and they require um, drivers to stop for anyone standing on the curb or a crosswalk ramp. Ann Arbor is Michigan's only city where drivers are expected to anticipate a pedestrian's desire to cross the street. You need to stop your vehicle even before someone enters the crosswalk. Most of the cars like are pretty good about stopping like pedestrians kind of like rule the streets. <laughs> but that outlook sometimes makes pedestrians a little too confident. But like I've definitely seen kids like just kind of dive in, but the, the cars are good. They're like good about stopping, yeah. even if they're a little annoyed, you know. It's pretty safe. You know, sometimes you get people blaring their horn at you, but otherwise it's all right. Supporters of the current ordinance argue that pedestrians, especially children and people with disabilities, shouldn't have to risk their life by first entering a crosswalk to make drivers stop for them. Ann Arbor police have issued hundreds of tickets. And no, this is not a sneaky way to generate revenue for the city budget. We aren't doing this to make money. Um, and I know that's a common misperception. Um, we really are trying to make it safer for pedestrians. Councilman Eaton has proposed a traffic study to see what really works best for drivers and pedestrians. In Ann Arbor, I'm Steve Garagiola, Local 4.